Advanced Data Flow enables the graphical view of simulated netlist. To enable this option, go to Design menu, Settings, Simulation. Here enable Generate Data for Advanced Data Flow. Let's compile the design. Everything looks OK. Now we will initialize the simulation. You can bring up the advanced data flow window by clicking on the icon and then dragging the module in the data flow window. Or you can right click on the module and choose the option add to advanced data flow. You can double click on the module to see what's inside the module. Let's check some options of pins from context menu. The option Expand Net to Readers tells us which elements of our design are reading this net. Similarly, we can check the option Expand Net to Drivers. We can turn off the hierarchy mode. In that case, the black rectangles will disappear, which will give us a better view. This is called Flat Mode. You can check which sources are driving this net. Results will be displayed in the console. We can turn on the gray mode. In that case, everything will turn gray, but the selected net will be highlighted in red. We can also display trace window, which will let us quickly navigate through the elements of our design just by clicking the path. If you run the simulation, you can see the values changing on the nets. We can try the same thing from script by using dash adv data flow switch in the asim command. Let's run the selection in the script and add the module in advanced data flow window as we did before. Thank you for watching this presentation.